So as always, this is part of a series. Be sure to check out the link in the description of this video to the full playlist. As always, uh, I recommend you watch the previous videos. New ones going up every week. We've been working mainly with grep this week, searching through files for matching strings. And um, also in the previous video, I showed you how to use WC to count lines, words, and um, and characters, that's what I was thinking, uh, of a file. Uh, but let's say you want to get the number of times a particular word appears. Now we could always use grep and pipe the output into WC. We haven't actually gotten into piping in this series yet. Uh, but grep actually has, if we go into the grep manual by typing man grep, uh, you can see there is a built-in functionality right here, dash C or dash dash count, to count the number of matches. Um, so here we go, we can say grep, and we can say line, and we can say the file name, and again, that displays how many times the word line appears in a file, and, or how many, yeah, displays the matches. Always good to put quotations, you don't have to in all cases, but it's a good habit to get into. And I can do dash C and it returns, but here it's returning the number of lines. Just want to be clear on that, the number of lines that the word line appears on. Uh, I can also do dash I, which would make it case insensitive, which adds an extra line in there. So it's not actually counting the number of matches, it's counting the number of lines it's returning that have matches on it. Just as if you were to pipe it into WC uh, with a dash L argument. Uh, but so I just wanted to show you that uh, I have a bad habit of piping into WC when using grep and really I don't have to because grep has that built-in functionality. So I hope you enjoyed this video. As always, uh, it'd be great if you became a supporter over at patreon.com forward slash melx1000. If you can't support me financially, you can support me by liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to my channel. Uh, if you have any questions, be sure to comment below. If you have any comments, uh, maybe a different way of doing the things I'm doing, be sure to comment below. Uh, I thank you for watching. As always, please visit my website, filmsbychris.com. That's Chris with a K. There should be a link in the description. And I hope that you have a great day.